These toys are created specially for people with plenty of money. So if you have plenty of money, enthusiasm, and a childlike attitude, then worry not. You'll get the pleasure of the entire universe just by playing with these sophisticated toys. Without further ado, let's start the video. F-16 Jet Aircraft Who doesn't know about the F-16 military aircraft? This legendary and iconic aircraft is highly maneuverable and has proven itself in air-to-air -air combat and air-to-air -air surface attack. It provides a relatively low-cost, high-performance weapon system for the United States and allied nations, and over 4,500 F-16s have been manufactured so far. However, this mind-blowing aircraft replica model is a fifth the size of the real F-16 and flies in the sky like a shark underwater with a wingspan of 2 meters. This flying toy weighs around 18 kilograms or 40 pounds. This aircraft flies very elegantly while producing a pleasant noise for the ears. TriStar It's been over half a century since the Lockheed L-1011 TriStar first flew. The plane was introduced with several creative innovations that helped the aviation industry adapt to a new era. The jet could perform blind landings in zero visibility weather. At the time of launch, this legendary aircraft had speed control, a flight control system, a navigation system, a stability system, a direct lift control system, and an autopilot. Passengers loved riding in it thanks to a unique engine configuration that reduced sound in the cabin. A total of 250 TriStar jets were produced by Lockheed. However, unlike the original aircraft, this replica was created in 4,000 hours. Its turbines were built without CNC. This cutie plane is operated by a great model enthusiast, Dominic Escher. This replica is 16 times smaller than the original Lockheed TriStar. The model weighs 20 kilograms and is 3.4 meters long with a 3-meter wingspan. A-12 Ox Cart This is the A-12 Ox Cart, the coolest and most amazing plane ever created. This model was supposed to be the biological father of the SR-71, operated by the CIA, and it remained a hidden secret from the world for 40 years. This model is an eighth of the replica of the original SR-71 that weighs 24 kilograms or 52 pounds with 2B-140F or 2B-160F jet engines. It's 4 meters long with a total wingspan of 2 meters. The most surprising thing about this beast is its mind-blowing speed of 170 miles per hour or 270 kilometers per hour. With its 7 liners of fuel capacity to maintain speed, the model is like the royalty of the sky. Stug 3 Tank when we see tanks, we often think a full-fledged war is ongoing between two countries. Meet the Stug 3 tank, a smaller and compact version that's about a sixth of the size of the original thing. This amazing, mind-blowing model is manufactured by a UK-based company, ArmorTech. And in terms of dimension, it's 3.6 feet long and 1.6 wide. Well, your eyes are forcing you to think that this killer machine is very heavy, but don't listen to your deceiving eyes because this tank is very lightweight and weighs just 45 kilograms or 99 pounds, even though its entire body is made of metal. 
The details and quality of work are so amazing that even my words are paralyzed to describe this amazing tank that produces a more pleasant sound than Taylor Swift's, <laughs> especially her new album. Many retired engineers or machinists love making small-scale replicas of steam locomotives. The work involved in making them is amazing. Often it takes hundreds of hours. At this place, which is a locomotive heaven, these trains are strong enough to carry an adult person on these tiny tracks. Today's modern trains run on diesel and electricity, but centuries ago, things were different. It was a time of steam engines. Let's discuss a little bit of history first. Many people don't know that the first steam engine was invented by a blacksmith, Thomas Newcomen, in 1705. Surprisingly, this steam technology was used in the mining industry to pump water out. After that, a popular Scottish engineer, James Watt, improved the previous steam engine, which significantly paved the way for the creation of steam locomotives and the Industrial Revolution. However, after several breakthroughs and research, English engineer George Stephenson designed the first public steam engine train in 1814. It was chosen as the best steam locomotive to run the railways for the masses. Regardless of the complicated train history, there's no doubt that the future of these locomotives is getting brighter over time. This amazing attack helicopter doesn't need an introduction at all. Everyone knows how deadly the Apache AH-64 could be, especially in the sky. This amazing furious baby replica is a seventh of the size of the real Apache AH-64 and is manufactured by an amazing German company, Vario Helicopter. They've been supplying scale helicopter models and trains since 1974 and offer an excellent variety of spare parts. However, many baby Apache models are created by enthusiasts too, with a four-blade rotor head and tail rotor. This Apache model weighs just 17 kilograms or 37 pounds, is 2.2 meters long, 0.78 meters wide, and 0.6 meters high. The most important part is its pretty big rotor, around 2.1 meters in diameter. The attention to detail is excellent. All you need are real rockets, missiles, and guns attached to the frame. Just kidding. <laughs> the RC's round is also very realistic, and there is something about the sound of an attack helicopter that says, be afraid, be very afraid. See you in the air. However, the price of this beast is around $2,670 or more. Concord. This legendary sharp-nosed aircraft that weighs 149 kilograms or 330 pounds was entirely constructed by the hands of Otto Wittelreuther. It took a total of three years for its creation. The Concorde looks like a very sharp needle or an injection that can fly in the air, and I don't want to be hit by it. By the way, I'm already vaccinated, so when you talk about its power, then be afraid. Regardless of size, you can see four very powerful JetCat P300 turbines. Each turbine produces 67 pounds of thrust. The only funny part about this plane is that its wheels are bigger than my shoes, and I wouldn't say I like this. The plane is so huge! Its body is made up of a carbon fiber sandwich. The model is a sixth of the size of the original thing, 10 meters long with 4 meter wingspan. Its stomach can hold up to 24 to 30 liters of fuel without compromising its performance. Scout Pulse Jet This toy is so fast! It blinks many times and you lose it from your vision. This aircraft weighs 7.5 kilograms or 17 pounds. 
5.5 feet long with 4 feet wingspan. It's very hard to ignore it. The most important thing about this flying toy is its speed. This cute toy can reach a maximum speed of 310 miles per hour or 500 kilometers per hour, thanks to its pulsed jet engine with 18 pounds of thrust. Flying this legendary masterpiece at such high speed isn't an easy task. It's operated by a master operator by Roger Noble. The Cobra Bell AH-1W is an American attack helicopter made by Bell Helicopter Company. The AH-1 Super Cobra is a further evolution of the original Vietnam War era, AH-1 Cobra born in the 1960s. The Super Cobra is differentiated primarily by its twin-engine configuration compared to the single-engine nature of the Cobra system. The United States Army doesn't use the AH-1 anymore. However, this amazing replica is a fifth of the real thing. The Cobra Bell weighs 29.5 kilograms or 65 pounds is 2.75 meters long and has 2.8 meter diameter. Liebherr Excavator 944B This is an amazing hydraulic RC excavator. Its name shines like gold in the mining construction or demolition industry. This small, complicated, sophisticated excavator toy may cost you 6,500 euros for the base model, and its price may go as high as 15,000 euro. Well, I don't know how to justify the price to you, but I am amazed at how these small cuties perfectly do their job. The excavator likes what it likes doing. Digging, grabbing wood, and transporting tree trunks and sewer pipes has never been this easy before Lebherr Excavator 944B. The muscular power in this mini monster comes from specially designed hydraulic pistons that you won't get anywhere else easily. The model weighs just 12 kilograms and looks like a replica of Libera Excavator 944B, but is 14 times smaller than that. Thanks for watching! Which crazy toy did you find the most impressive and why? Let me know in the comment section below. I'll see you guys in the next video. Until next time, peace!